Uh, Deanna, one woman I spoke with says her catalytic converter was stolen without her even knowing, and more people are falling victim each month. RPD says they've seen a 207% increase in thefts in the last year. Well, it caused like really inconvenience more than anything. Left without a car? It, it can cost several thousand dollars. This Richmond woman who preferred to remain anonymous says her Shaco Bottom neighborhood should be on the lookout after realizing her catalytic converter was stolen last week. Well, I went to put the plates on my car actually and um, that's what, when I started the car it sounded really loud. That's when I knew. That loud noise, a sure sign yours might be gone. The highly valuable parts cut down a car's toxic emissions and thieves are stealing them and making fast cash. The theft's been on the rise in the area, especially and here in this neighborhood we had um, for the last two months or so about seven seven incidents. This heat map given to us by Richmond police shows catalytic converter theft hotspots around the city. These targeting areas near Shaco Bottom, the museum district and south side. The number of thefts more than tripling over the past year. Something Captain Anthony Jackson says is hard to prevent. It can be done in a matter of seconds or you know just a couple of minutes is all it takes for someone to actually steal one. So it's a very quick happening crime. Uh, so which, which makes it harder for us to catch one in the act. Residents now urging neighbors to be aware. Of course, we all need to sleep at night and we can just run to our cars every hour, but you know, just be aware. So how can you protect yourself? Police say park near well lit areas near cameras and consider installing converter shields. That woman I spoke with says she got theft protection insurance one day before this all happened and is urging others to do the same. We're live in Richmond tonight. Delaney Hall, 8 News.